Hi, this is Bob Wasson, and this is the Weekly Dirt. Um, this week, we'd like to talk about one of the most common problems we see during the month of June. Uh, right now, it's a beautiful day, mid-June here in Fishers, Indiana, and I am with the Knockout Rose, one of our most popular plants. And uh, like I said, the most common problem we see during this time of the year is people bring in samples of their leaves and uh, complain that there's something wrong. It's either a disease or something's eating it. They can never find the bug. Um, what this actually is, it is a bug. It's a pest. It's called the rose slug, which is actually a very tiny worm. Um, they're lime green. They blend into the leaf, so they're very hard to see. Um, but you can see a, a close-up of the pest right here. That there's two stages of this leaf being um, eaten. There's large holes that are all the way through the leaf, and then there are these holes that look like just the bottom layer has been eaten and the film over the top is still there. So it looks like a light brown spot, which some people think is a disease, but it's actually the little tiny, tiny, tiny uh, baby rose slugs that can't eat all the way through the leaf yet. Left unchecked, these little guys can actually kill your rose bush. They will eat it until it's completely bare and nothing but a lacy resemblance of what used to be a plant. Um, so they can kill your rose if you don't do anything about it and I'm gonna show you how to do that. For products like eight and seven, do what's called a contact kill. Uh, whenever you spray the rose, anything, any of the pests that it touches, it will kill, um, but also it leaves some residual on the leaf as the pest is doing its job and eating through the plant, they will get some of that chemical and eventually die. Um, another product that you can use is Bayer Rose and Flower called a systemic, which means that the active ingredients are, are poured into the ground and taken up through the roots, almost like if you're a human and you get a, a shot at the doctor or you take vitamins, it just makes the plant stronger and it, it prevents and stops pest infestations um, by having the chemical pumped through their, their veins, basically. So today I'm gonna use eight, and like you saw, the pest is on the underside of the leaf the rose slug. So what we're going to do is coat the plant with eight. We're going to try to soak as much of the plant as we can, but since this pest was on the underside of the leaf, also wear your gloves and uh, try to get in underneath and get some of this product into the center of the plant and on the underside of the leaves. Um, as much as you can get in there, it's just going to help couple important things to note. You never want to spray insecticides during the heat of the day. Um, always do it in the morning or, or later in the evening when the full sun is not shining on the leaf because it can burn. Also, for heavy infestations, you may want to spray every 10 days uh, up to three applications. 